So I went to shoot with my homie Dimitri today on the X100V and how was that experience? So it was a pretty cool experience and I'm, I'm used to shooting on Fuji a little bit because I owned an X100S for a little while which I just sold because I upgraded to the X-T4 but it was cool shooting on this because it was very similar to the X100S but every five minutes I figured out something new about this camera that blew my mind. First of all, it's like 100 times sharper than the X100S. <laughs> yeah. I got the X100S in, what, like a year ago? It was made in 2013. So, do you know when this one was made? Like a couple years ago, it's fairly new. Show. Okay, yeah, 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 you can tell. Yeah. And first of all, you can take a picture on this thing just by touching the screen and it has a tilt screen. Y'all, I know that's the kind of stuff that you would think shouldn't be so mind blowing, but again, I had a, what, 10 year old, 10 years older camera than this one. Oh, yeah. And so all of that stuff was pretty amazing to me. And no matter how I took the picture and what kind of lighting conditions, the photos came out super sharp every time. So I loved it. I don't, didn't want to give it back. Wish I could take it home, but Jamal won't let me borrow it indefinitely. So I had to return it to his owner. But it was a pretty cool experience. I didn't have much to shoot, but I mean, with that camera, I mean, you can take a picture of a brick wall and it'll make it magical, so. That's some good insight. And it's a pretty popular camera. It's been trending, well, I think like for months it's been trending on TikTok. So it's pretty popular. I got mine for a steal, so I'm never selling this. Yeah. But um, it was pretty cool getting out today. At first we couldn't find much, but we really made something out of nothing today which was pretty neat so i got some editing to do it felt really good to just get out and like create again though yeah, and, and not been, have any pressure it's been a long time for me since i did any kind of photo walk or any kind of like being behind the camera man i had gotten away from it for a while i had gotten away from taking photos for a while and my soul like there's a photography's in my soul and so being away from the camera for so long, I had started to yearn and long for it. And so I'm glad we got a chance to go out and I'm glad I got a chance to experience the X100V finally, the most, one of the most popular Fuji cameras there is. If you Google Fujifilm, there's no way you're going to scroll 
two times without seeing this camera being mentioned. So it was pretty cool. I wish I had it. I wish I had one. But I wanted to go the cheap route, so I got an older one, which that older camera gave me some very, very great uh, photos. Yeah, it's not too bad. So now we're about to end it. Yep. Yeah. Tag line. Much love and peace. Yeah. <laughs> you said the piece, <laughs> Follow me on Instagram at Dimitri Develops. Yeah, that's it. He's gonna edit that part out. No, I'm not. I'm keeping it in. <laughs> <laughs>